Hi guys, welcome to the channel. In today's video, we are going to cover the features that are released as part of version 33. So the the build version is 23192. So as part of this video, I'm just covering top four features, which I feel are top four according to me, but there are other features available as part of different components of A360 platform. I'll mention the link of the release note you have a read about the rest of the features. So first is AI Agent Studio. We'll talk about AI Agent Studio, then Advanced Debugging, and then Autopilot. And after that, we'll talk about Enhanced Automation Templates. AI Agent Studio. That's a buzzword around the internet, right? So Automation Anywhere in their Imagine event announced AI Agent Studio. So AI Agents, what exactly, before knowing the Agent Studio, what exactly are AI Agents? AI Agents are the next gen tools that can adapt and learn from the data that you provide and along with your repetitive bots that you code uh, the, they can add some decision making power right so you can build your agents along with your bots using ai agent studio you will be now able to develop these agents manage and build your bots and incorporate these ai agents wherever required the components that would be part of AI Agent Studio are AI skills, model connections, enrich enterprise context, AI security and governance control. What do you mean by AI skills? So these, these you can develop some skills. This would help you to power your AI agents. These skills are like basically using fundament, foundational models. Uh, you can reuse them across your automations. It will be created using fine tuned prompts. For example, you as an individual have certain skills, right? You have a database skills or JavaScript or coding skills. Similarly, uh, you can create those specific skills termed as AI skills that will have a specifically crafted um, uh, prompts that can be utilized across your bots. Then we have model connection. So that will allow you to choose from a variety of models available like AWS Bedrock, Microsoft Azure, OpenAI, Google Vertex AI, and stuff like that. Then in the enterprise context, you can enhance your model outputs and reduce error with the RAG, Retrieval Augmented Generation capability. So Automation Anywhere have already integrated with uh, these with their partners like AWS, GCP, and OpenAI. And the fourth point, which is AI security and governance control. It's like all about governing your data right what models can be used what criteria or compliance requirement or regulatory requirements are there in order to use certain features in ai most important thing this feature is only available to cloud customer at the moment at this time well, while i'm creating this video and it requires enterprise platform license this is how the ai agent studio might look like in your control room now we can debug the child bot which was earlier a pain area, right? Before this version, this features will enable developers to debug their automations end to end. This is how the option would look like while you are debugging your bot. So there is step in and step out icons that are added to the tool set. And you can, you'll be able to see the call stack, how the call is getting managed from parent to child bots and vice versa. If you need a more detailed video with an example, comment down below. I'll create a specifically dedicated video on this topic. Then we have autopilot. So autopilot helps customer to leverage Gen AI to convert their process maps into automation. So right from the discovery to creating a workflow and creating your automation. So it makes it easy for developers to create the end to end process, like basically have a, have a initial framework created. For example, you, you got certain requirements and based on those requirements, your bot is already being created. A workflow has been created and certain pieces, certain modules have already been coded using automation co-pilot for automators. All you have to do is you have to tweak that automation, which is auto-generated. It saves some of your efforts with the initial, uh, not starting any, uh, from scratch. This feature is again only available to cloud customers at the time of recording this video. And it requires the Automator AI platform base license. Create a process here, process composer in your process composer, and the task boards would be created with the help of automation co-pilot for automators. 
enhanced automation templates. With this feature, you are able to create and reuse templates that are quite repetitive in nature. For example, if you want to establish certain best practices, similar to what we had for A360 taskbots, right? We created our bot framework and we, we saved that as a template. So whenever a new automation is going to start, we use that template as a reference, as a boilerplate code or as a part of our framework, then we build on top of it. So similar option is now available for your processes. As you can see in the picture, it's process template. Earlier, it was only available for task bots, A360 task bots. Now it is available for processes as well. Thank you. Please let me know your feedback regarding the video, what part you liked, and if you need any detailed video, please comment down below. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel and keep watching, keep supporting. Thank you so much.